Not now though. <laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to my channel, All Things Yes. I hope you guys are safe and well. If this is your first visit, then welcome to my channel. My name is Yaz, but if this is your second, third, or even fourth visit to my channel, then stop fighting it any longer. You know what you want to do. You want to hit that subscribe button, ring my bell, and join the crazy designer addicted family. If you have a hankering for all things designer and luxurious, just like me, then this is the place for you. In today's video, I have an and other stories haul for you, so let's get straight to it. Okay guys, so in today's video I have three and other stories items to show you. Now, I know it's relatively small for a haul, but I'm trying to cut back on how much I buy clothing wise, just because my wardrobe is already full and my house was not built with storage in mind, so rather irritating. But I'm trying to pick out those versatile pieces that I can wear with numerous outfits. So that's why I've added a styling part to this video at the end. If you guys like it, let me know in the comments down below and I'll do this for every haul. I'm gonna take these three items and try and create as many outfits as I can or a couple of outfits just to get an idea in my head of what works with these items. It also helps me because I struggle visually to um, visualize outfits so it's helpful for me to be able to put an outfit together and then in my mind I'll be like right I can go back to that one. But it should help you guys as well if you have similar items like this or go on to purchase these items you can see what you like and what you think works and what you think doesn't so you know how to wear these items as well. So without further ado let's get into the items. I must say, before we get into the items though, I do love Under the Stories. Now, I'm from the Northeast. We don't get stores like this up here. The last time I went into an Under the Stories store was in London, and I think that was in November, and I loved it. But even online, it's amazing. The quality from Under the Stories is great. I have a couple of their pieces. So, up first, we have this gorgeous green satin mini skirt, and I saw this and instantly, oops, instantly fell in love with it. Look at the way it like shimmers. This satin effect on it is absolutely gorgeous. And I saw it and I thought you can wear that both casually and a bit dressed up and perfect for both spring and summer. When I saw it I thought Chanel, Chanel slides, basic crop top would look amazing in Portugal whenever I'll be able to get there. <laughs> But yeah, and it's the perfect length, so it's not too short and it's not too long, just above the knee, well slightly a bit more above the knee. <laughs> but I found it really hard to get this, they've got a clasp in here, and I found it really hard when you have this on to clasp it. It looks better when it is clasped, when it isn't clasped it looks like you can't do it all the way up, which I really don't like. But yeah, I found it really hard to do that on, so I just left it off, but I think I might just have to get used to doing that. But yeah, really pretty pretty mini skirt. Let me know in the comments what we think of that one. And then it was actually paired with this online which is this ribbed cropped jumper with this gorgeous like see-through button detail but also when you wear it it kind of like creates down the middle a little bit of skin. You can see a little bit of the skin going down so I really like that. Just a nice added touch. Long sleeves, although I think they could have done a short version of this as well, which would have been nice. Now, they did pair it with the skirt online, but on me, I don't know if it looks right because I think on the model, her torso is a little bit longer, so you can see a little bit of skin, whilst on me, I have a short torso. Um, so I don't know if it looked as well. I did do it as an outfit, so you guys could see them paired together. But I thought mum jeans, pair of trainers or slides would look amazing with this. 
and it's not exactly thick so it'd be perfect both in spring and summer summer more on those cooler days and I was thinking of Portugal again because on the nights it can get a bit chilly and I just thought this would look amazing um, but yeah really comfy really stretchy I'm just loving the button detail it's really pretty okie dokie okay and on to the third and final item now before I show you this dress I um, I've been wanting a dress a new dress a new colorful dress for a while those regulars you'll have heard me say in a couple of my videos and I'm specifically talking about my All Saints dress which is black and white floral I've definitely got brighter but I've basically just gone and bought a very similar dress but this one's in white and black polka dots and I just instantly thought Denim jacket, Gucci sandals would work so well with this, and it does. I adore this dress. Now, I do want to mention one thing. This may run a little bit small, or it may be the fit of the dress, or it may be I've gained weight during lockdown. I don't know. It is the perfect size for me, but I have a tiny bit of breathing room. So, if you guys are looking for a dress and you think this, this is the one for you, I'd just consider that when buying this. Um, I don't know whether to return it and get the 38, which is a UK 12, but then I, think, I feel like that might be just slightly too oversized. Um, so I think I'm going to stick with this one and hope by the time we get out of lockdown I can go to the gym and before I go on holiday this will fit like a treat and I'll have just that extra bit of breathing room. Um, but it's absolutely gorgeous. I think it's the perfect length. It's got this really nice frilly bro frilly bottom. It tucks you in at the waist which again I love and it's got kind of like these puff sleeves because it's got like this tight bit around here. Again a little bit of frill there and a really nice like heart shaped neckline. It's the perfect like pretty easy summer dress can be worn both casually and a little bit more dressed up and I, I do adore it. It's really pretty. So yeah, I hope you like those three items. I hope you like the next part of this video. Um, but otherwise, this concludes the video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what you think, which is your favorite outfit from the next bit. And also stay tuned for a lounge wear review haul coming next week. Thank you so much. Stay safe and bye for now. Mm -hmm.